For many delivery riders, a supersized cargo box worn like a backpack and a powerful e-bike are all that's needed to keep goods moving in the city. Multiple large packages require bigger thinking, as seen in Honda's upcoming Fastport e-quad. No, it's not as cute as Honda's electric city car, but it can go where cars and vans can't, such as bike lanes, where regulations allow. The four-wheeled last-mile package delivery solution relies on pedal power that's assisted by the onboard motor up to 12 miles per hour, and a Honda Mobile Power Pack swappable battery that's reckoned good for 23 miles fully loaded. That per charge range figure is for the larger of the two available configurations, which is rated to haul payloads up to 650 pounds in total outback, within a box measuring 89 by 60 by 47.9 inches. The range for the small box version, which has a payload capacity of 320 pounds for its 75 by 57.5 by 39.4 inches cargo box, is still being determined at this time. The E-Quad is reported to be equipped with a unique pedal-by-wire pedal assist powertrain though no further details have been revealed. It also comes with numerous energy-saving technologies such as Reagan braking to potentially extend battery range and an automatic parking brake. The rider sits under a transparent canopy that should keep at least some of the driving rain at bay, though the sides are exposed. In kinder weather, there's a UV coating and optional ceramic tint, plus a ventilation fan that could help keep things cool on a hot day. The photos of the prototype show shocks at each wheel for a smooth ride, a headlight and LED strip light to the front while the renders add turn signaling and a braking tail light to the safety equation. It looks like a tablet-like display will also sit mid-handlebar for navigation, scheduling info and ride data. The E-Quad is being produced under a new fleet-as-a-service subbrand called Fastport, which will make its global debut at Eurobike 2025 in Frankfurt, Germany, where the E-Quad prototype will also be unveiled. Honda is looking to have the first vehicles ready for North American and European clients towards the close of the year, with mass production penciled in for mid-2026. We're no stranger to pedal assist delivery quads of course, and have seen Amazon going for a ride on London streets, with the Evo 1 nipping at its wheels, while the capable yak bike ups the payload ante on three wheels. It will be interesting to see how Honda's new subbrand rolls in one of the most complex and costly segments of the logistics chain.